Good evening, I'm Bevan Castahoon. We begin tonight with a call for help going out across western New York as the region faces a critical need for blood donations. This is a problem that's been growing, especially in the last few years. According to the American Red Cross, the blood supply dropped 25% between August and September 11th. The Red Cross says that it starts to uh, rebound, but they estimate that they'll need to collect 10,000 more blood products per week for the next month in order to meet hospital and patient needs nationwide. That's why tonight our Joss in person is turning the mic over to the people who know this issue too well and are working to do something about it. I'm Jocelyn Person in front of the Connect Life Mobile Blood Drive, where they're calling for you to donate blood as the shortage continues here in Western New York. So they need your help to save a life. Blood pretty much travels everywhere nowadays with like the technology that we have. So it's it's science, it's a nice gesture that anybody can do. That's why at least 26 donors came to the Connect Life Mobile Blood Drive Friday to do their part in rolling up their sleeves and donating blood. And some tell me they feel like Superman doing so. At least once I wanted to be a hero, you know, and things like this, it's like, I guess a little it's like a little touch in that in, in that space. Connect Life says 30% of Americans are eligible to donate blood, but only 3% do annually. It's really tough because if you had all of that 30% coming in and donating, even just once a year, we probably wouldn't be talking. You wouldn't need to put this on the news. If your blood type is O negative, Connect Life needs you. Since Buffalo General Hospital is in need of at least 39 units of O negative blood on the shelf. Currently, it only has 12. We are cleared out just about of most of the O negative blood we have, and hospitals are asking for more, and we're doing our best to get it to them. In this mobile blood drive, they received five O positive donors, while the rest have been A positive donors. But they're also calling for the black and Latino community to roll up their sleeves, too. Um, black people, we're constantly in need of, we have different blood disorders that most other um, races do not face. So we receive a lot of the blood, so it'd be nice to see, you know, people come in to actually donate. And when you see this mobile blood drive roaming around, just know you'll also be rewarded while being a superhero by helping save lives. For $250 Ellicottville staycation, uh, we're giving out a couple of those every week. Um, anytime you come in, you're getting bonus points that you can earn, use towards gift cards at Amazon. Doing things like this, it's always, it's, it's, not, it's definitely beneficial to everyone, honestly. There's a lot of people out there who need help. Now I've posted all the details of the scheduled mobile blood drive and where else you can go to donate blood on WKBW.com. In Buffalo, Jocelyn Person, 7 News.